Hey guys, and uh, welcome back to Let's Play The Walking Dead. Um, we're gonna probably do chapters uh, three and four in this part because doing a single chapter by itself is a little, uh, you know, it only takes me about maybe 10 or 15 minutes to get through an actual chapter. Um, I'm uploading, so if there is a bit of a lag or anything, I apologize. I'm like usually like the only people, the only person to like notice stuff like that because I'm so anal about like the graphics of my computer and things like that. But whatever. Uh, uh, Looks uh, like there's man. two guys. I ain't never getting home to trying to push this car away. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. Oh, it's hot dish night. All right. Didn't we already click open the gate? He is like What's the bloody. Matter? He needs to Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Um I don't know. I don't know. Neither do I. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. That is a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Um, what's going Do on? Do you know what the hell this is? Because they still don't no realize idea. they're in a zombie See, apocalypse. Seen them, like... You could say that. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. He's Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. <laughs> How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... I'm a neighbor. A neighbor. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long said. is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... For some reason, I think we should remember the address 5240. I'm, that's just, Let's go. I don't know, I'm, I'm weird like that. Oh shit, we gotta help him move this car. Okay. Come on, move this car. Oh, Clementine comes to help. Isn't that cute? Like, what are those guys neighbors too and if you notice the edges get uh they get red during the video game when you're when there's a zombie really really close or you're close to dying or something like that so yeah Like we're going to Herschel's farm and some of you might get that some of you might not even though in the te television show the farm hey, looks Sean, much different I'm gonna run on home my mom was gonna be in a snit no sweat man I'll catch you tomorrow night it was nice to meet you both I love how Clementine like to holds his hand and all that cute stuff. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Well, Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You've brought a couple guests. Um, we need a place to we, stay. We uh, need a place to stay. You're welcome to stay here, but just for the night. I don't run a bed and breakfast. So it's just you and your daughter, then? Oh, not his daughter. He was her neighbor. 
Honey, do you know this man? Didn't he just kill you, bitch? Like Yes. Th th it was his neighbor. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. It's a Let's lot a of look. storytelling in this game. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Could be worse. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? Um... I fell. I, I fell, trying to get away from one of those things. That's so. What type of danger has the girl seen? Um, who knows? Who knows? She had a few lonely days with nothing but the dead keeping her company. I still just can't imagine it. Consider yourself lucky. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clementine. Clementine. She's so Can't cute. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think <laughs> anyone knows how big it is yet. Um, your son is right. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. Um... I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. <laughs> Clementine was like, what we'll the We'll clean fuck? it, redress it, and you'll be fine. <laughs> okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Um, Towards making, I suppose. We should have been able to choose that option, but whatever. All right then. This is a law of storytelling, as you can see. It smells like. It smells like shit. <laughs> oh, look! It smells like shit. You know. I know what it smells like. Duty. <laughs> oh, duty. <laughs> So cute. I miss my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. I wonder what happened between him and his wife. Like, what really happened, you know, between him and his wife. Or whoever. I don't even know what he's convicted. Obviously, he's convicted for killing his wife, right? Or his ex wife, or I don't know. I have no idea. Like, no idea. Hey, get up. <sighs> what an itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of the fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. 
That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Dod Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! See? The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Um... Maybe let's see how things turn out. We'll see how things shake out with this Herschel guy. <laughs> Good luck with that. He's a hard ass. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On he the seems tractor? like such a genuinely cool. good guy. Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Okay, so we need to walk around here, I guess. What can we do? Be sure to check in with everyone that you've met so far. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Um, need any help? Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean, in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Um, no kids. Uh, I'm okay. I think I've got it handled okay. As long as I keep her safe, I uh, think I'm doing all right. With those things out there, maybe. Sure, that's enough. But you gotta ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. I'll keep that in mind. Um, what's your plan? So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got It'll a be boat. like the perfect place for I'm a commercial fisherman, with. catching mackerel, dolphin, a boat. whatever's biting like and seriously. paying. You're out in the Kachi wouldn't the be ocean. wild about well, it, actually, but the boat's the not that bad. Then you're all dead. So. How's your son doing? You know. Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. I See thought so. Alright, so, um... Where to now? Looks like they're over there working on the fence. Oops, they ran into the tree. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. There's so much story to this game. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Um, was the boy one was of the Was the walkers? boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh, uh... I had to shoot one. Sometimes it's kill. I patched the poor girl's brain in. Sometimes it's kill. <laughs> Making these decisions like yes. they're a little... I don't think I'd sleep good know. after that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Sean Dad just wants to keep the that. family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? Um, my parents live in Macon. My brother and parents are in Macon. 
Uh, hope. Okay, so it must be his oh, ex-wife. Man. I hope so too. I don't know. Maybe it's not too happened. bad there. We're not even gonna mention his wife. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. So I guess now we go talk to Herschel. Screw the little boy. You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. What the fuck are you talking about, not dude? Sure, I follow. How'd you get out of Atlanta? Um, I was on my way. Out. I was on my way out anyway. The timing of all this just happened to be right. Huh? If there ever is a good time for the supposed. Did we even mention Atlanta? Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. <laughs> Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, so I guess so was I. Family's important. That's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? Uh, my parents, my parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Um, uh, I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. I was looking... Yeah, I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. But you better become a better liar, and fast. Let's say things don't problem. get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. So whoever you are and whatever you did, keep it to your damn self. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Let's do Something's Go! happening. I'll get my gun. Something is happening. <laughs> Zombie. you up. It, it almost it almost got me, man. It, Lee tried to save me. I know, son. I... Uh, oh, don't you hate when they can't get their last words out? Isn't that, like, sad? Sorry. 
Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. You tried to help him, but this piece of shit let him die. Yes, he did. Uh, it's nobody's fault. It's Kenny's fault. It's my fault. Um, I don't even know what to say. You can't blame Kenny. It's nobody's fault. The hell I can't. You watch your back. We can tell it's your daughter and you need his help. Please. Just go. Aww. Get out and never come back. He said never come back. Maybe we should have been quiet in case we needed his help to come back to this damn farm in the future. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. So it looks like we're going to make them. Make them. Whatever, make them. Yeah. Alright, guys. Uh, this looks like a pretty good place to kind of end all of this. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to pick up and we're going to be in Chapter 5, I think. When we get back and all of that good stuff. Um, and it looks like we're in Macon, I guess. Yeah. So, I will talk to you guys all later. Don't forget to like and favorite this video. Um, and follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Well, and subscribe to the channel if you really going. like what you're watching. Because I think enough. it's a really good story. So, yeah. Alright guys, I'll talk to you later. Bye.